Hello. Today we'll be playing the Lemonade Stand song. And remember that this is a little bit special song because it's the first three, four times song that we've played. And you know when that happens, we count only to three and we'll repeat. So we'll go one, two, three, one, two, three. Normally we do one, two, three, four, right? So here we only have three beats per measure, so that's why we count only to three. And then we also got ties in this song. And remember, ties are when there's two notes that are right next to each other and they're the same exact note. When I say that, I mean they're both C's or both D's or both E's. So they're both on the same line or both on the same space, okay? And then they'll be connected by a curved line. And when that happens, it means you hold the note for the length of both the notes combined. So what I mean by that is if you have two quarter notes, if they're connected by that tie, that curved line, then you'll just hold it for the same length of those two quarter notes, which is one quarter note plus one quarter note. It's two quarter note worth, so it's two beats worth. So you'll just hold it like it's a half note. Okay. So in the song, the end of the second row and end of the fourth row, we got dotted half note ties, right? There is one dotted half note tied to the other dotted half note. So one dotted half note is worth three beats. If you tie it to another one that's worth three beats, three plus three is six. Right. And so we'll hold the note for six beats. All right. All right. So those are just the little things to pay attention to when you listen to me play this. All right. You can count to three in your head while I'm playing. Try to feel the beat of the music. All right. So one, two, three. Alright, now I'll play a little bit faster at this cheerfully tempo, as it suggests. Here we go. One, two, three. All right.